Okay, my name is Toby Osho. I'm the first child of the family of four from Ogun State. Okay, apart from music, um, I have a business um, I do. Um, sell building materials and all that. Yeah, so I'm not an active, you know, partner in that business. I'm just a passive. I just invest my money. And then I can also do ministry by the side. Yeah. Well, I've been singing for since age nine. Yeah, I joined the adult choir at age nine in church. And then um, I've been leading worship and all that. So, yeah, singing since age nine. And I, I released an EP last year. Um, the title of this EP was uh, Beyond Sound. So it had Jesus Yes You Reign, No One Is Like You, and some couple of other songs. It was really um, a blessing to a lot of people. And um, this year, um, I'm about releasing a song on the 31st of this, this month. The title of the song is Oyedi Kaji. Um, you can check my Instagram handle to, to know what's up on that. Okay, um, gospel, well, I would say this, you know, I mentioned earlier, I started singing in church from the age of nine, so I'd always known this was what I was going to do, even though at some point I went for some talent, I went for Project Fame, I think it was um, after my, my final year in school, that was 2014, yeah, so I went for Project Fame, you know, and then, but the, 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 I had an encounter. That was how I knew this was what I, wanted, I was going to do. You know, spending some time praying, and then I had an encounter with someone. I saw like a white man was walking. I was walking with him, and then I was singing, and then I was crying. Like I was worshiping, and then I worshiped out from the that encounter. I was also crying when I woke up. So it was like more like it was not like a cry of um, sadness and all, but it was the cry of you know, all of God and all that. So I knew this was what I was going to do full time. Even my parents had encounters and they knew this was what I was going to do full time. Yeah, but I have my business I do on the, on the side. Hmm, the plenty of. But um, I think one of the, one of the ones that, um, yeah, the normal, the common one is the, the issue of money. You know, that's the, it's a very sensitive that most musicians would, would talk about. It's, um, it's an issue. But personally for me, I don't you know, charge for ministration. It's an instruction. You know, so I don't do that for now. I don't do that. So, um, and then I've had to deal with some things. You know, going with my team. And then, I didn't, because you, you, know, you tell them you, you know, I'm not charging. And then you get to the place. You know, logistics. You have to sort out logistics <laughs> yourself and all that, you know. So it's it's sad though, but I, I believe that um, um, things are changing. You know, things are are changing. I know things are getting better, you know, in this country. So I've seen a lot of people who started with gospel left because of this, uh, you know, this, this reason. You know, I think the best thing is just to have something you're doing. You know, you know, you don't have to, you know go all out and say, okay, you want to do full-time? Yeah, there are people who have been called to full-time, but it's not all the time you, you do that. My testimonies are, they are like thousands, you know, but I would, I would just pick one. Um, that was a day, okay. And it was two years ago, I went for my, to register for my uh, international passport. Right, I went to Delta State to to do my national, uh, my international passport, and then I, I I went there with just the money I'm going to use to just pay. That's the money I'm going to use to get a passport, and then I was stranded. You know, I couldn't even call anybody at home. That uh, this, and this and this and this and this and that. I had I knew nobody. You know, and then what happened was, I was coming out from the one of the officers' office. You know, I just came out and then. Someone just walked by me and then said, sorry, are you so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-so-
And I said, yes, I'm, oh, I've seen one of your stuffs and I was so blessed. And this man actually brought out everything in his pocket. I bless you indeed. You know, so I, I was, I was, in fact, I was moved to tears. I was actually, like, I was, <laughs> like, ah. God is so mindful of us and all that. So uh, God is faithful. You know, that's just like one out of this. I still experienced one last week. You know, that's, God has been faithful. I get one. Just one. That one is strong, wait, wait. <laughs> I was <laughs> I was traveling to uh, this place, um, um, Enugu, for administration. All right? So, <laughs> I know he says, this one, I'm also stranded again. You know, but <laughs> what happened was, I, I, okay, I went, I went with um, about about um, six k. So I got to the park, and then the money I was the car, the, the the price for the for the for traveling was higher than what I expected. So I had to pay. And then I, I paid, and then something happened. The car stopped at um, at Ekiti. So, and that was the last money in my account. Ha! That day, I beg. I will not lie to you. I was. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at myself and said, God, <laughs> who, who sent me? You know, <laughs> but, you know, God showed up for me. He always shows up. So he showed up for me. And then someone just, I just, I think I sent one of my friends a message. And, blah, 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 and they said, ah, okay, sent me about thank you and all of that. So I had to use that to, uh, to, to go for the, for the program. And it was a huge success. In fact, lives were so touched in that program. Yeah, so. Those are one of my, in fact, that is like one of my embarrassing, crazy embarrassing moments. <laughs> when God calls you into an assignment, there's a process, you know. At times, you might not have the full grasp of what God has called you. You might just see, God might just show you, okay, what is this way going to be? You might see yourself singing in front of people. But then, there's a process between getting here and here. So, God will take you through that process for you to learn some things. So, you should not get weary in your assignment, you know. Don't get away your assignment. Keep doing what you're doing, you know, and then be faithful, be diligent, and serve. You know, service is key. Serve. Because I see a lot of people, they don't want to jump from one place to another, I want to, I want to blow, you know, but serve. Stay in one place, be faithful, and then um, watch God himself take you by his hand and take you by. God bless you. Keep doing what you're doing, and um, I love you. Okay. Honestly, I, I want to appreciate this platform because... Um, <laughs> Not so many people do something like this, you know. And then it's really a great privilege to have this kind of platform to reach out to people because the the hair wave is filled with jargons, you know. And then when we have people who are doing this, this kind of thing, you know, we should appreciate them. You know, it's it's and I appreciate this platform for bringing me on this show. It's it's it's, it's a great privilege, and I pray that God will continue to, you know, empower them, give them resources to continue this project, you know, to 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 reach out to people. And I want to appreciate, especially appreciate my, 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 my team also, the Ignition, the wonderful people, amazing, amazing, amazing musicians. All right.